Jet pumps or ejector pumps are used extensively in fuel systems and they work on the principle of the Venturi. So if we have, let's say, um, the wall of a tank here, you could have the jet pump installed on that tank and fuel from the booster pump would come along and we'll go in through the nozzle here. And you can see that this section here, um, you know, we're going from a large cross-sectional area to a small cross-sectional area. So the velocity of the fuel should, should build up and we should get a low pressure. So if we get a low pressure here, in this point here, that low pressure is used to draw fuel in from above to mix with this fuel and both the fuel from the booster pump and the fuel coming in on the suction line will go out through the outlet. Now to make sure that uh, the fuel from the booster pump doesn't go out through the outlet, there is a check valve in installed on the suction line. So check valve is here. So this only lets fuel coming in in one direction. So what happens is the fuel comes in, we get a low pressure point here. That low pressure sucks the fuel in from the, um, through the suction line and that fuel all goes out then through the outlet. Okay, so let's, let's look at an, an application of it. So there's our fuel pump just highlighted in blue. And here we have a fuel system. So we have a collector tank uh, where the engine, uh, sorry, where the booster pumps and the um, jet pumps are located. So when the booster pump is operating and the valve here is opened, so this is the transfer valve, the fuel transfer valve, and this is opened, fuel will be taken from the booster pump. Some of it will go to the engine and some of it will come through the um, transfer valve up into the ejector pump, create the low pressure here, and that's going to suck fuel from this tank in through the inlet, and both will mix, and the fuel will come back in here to the collector tank. Similar here with this jet pump. So the fuel comes from the, the booster pump, it'll go into the jet pump or the ejector pump. It creates a low pressure and that's going to take the fuel from this tank and draw it in through the inlet and they'll mix and then the fuel will all come into this tank. And this collector tank then is used to supply fuel to the booster pump and from there it goes to the engine. So that's a jet pump or ejector pump.